Everyone likes to work slightly differently or have different needs. And some of these can even change during the course of a day. I can set myself in and out of do not disturb, for example, or show colleagues that I'm out of the office. I can step in and out of answer groups during busy times. And I can also set my diverts very simply. Although personally, I tend to keep my desk phone twinned with my mobile, except of course when I'm on holiday. Furthermore, I can customise my PCS phone to show exactly what I want to see. Let's explore how we do this. Accessing the PCS phone settings can be done in two different ways. Either we can go to our favourites display, the up arrow, and then the settings button, or the settings button actually is concealed below the bottom right hand corner of the idle page, so we can just access it by depressing that button there. And then we're into settings, and we can see the settings that I've just been talking about, like DND, and I can tick that and go into that state. If I come back out now, I can see the double flashing speed of the blue S and also the red flash on the screen, making it very clear to both myself when I return to my desk and indeed others that my phone is in this state. To take it off, simply go back into the settings, untick it, and we've done it. Group key. I know that the sales team is getting a little bit uh, busy with calls at the moment, so simply by pressing the group key, I can go and select myself to be part of the sales group and now start receiving calls into the, uh, from, from the sales group number. Very quick, and very easy, and again, when I want to get out of that because it's quietened down a little bit, I can do so very quick and very simply. Status uh, gives me the ability to show other users on the system what I'm doing at that time. Am I in a meeting? Am I at lunch? Am I on holiday, perhaps? And this is now easily shown up on their handsets that that's the state I'm in. If I've pre-recorded some voicemail greetings appropriate to that, then they will get played as well automatically. And lastly, we have the diverts button. And diverts give us the option to set multiple different types of divert. First of all, we have personal. And the personal divert means that I just have my own personal calls, my DDI calls, routed to another extension. However, there's also dual personal. And in dual personal, that means that the calls are still ringing on my desk in the usual way, but now my DDI calls are being routed to that other extension or device. Now typically, the way I would use that is in uh, the office, I'd have all the calls ringing on my phone, but just my DDI calls routing through to that other device, which in my case would be my mobile. I can have all, and all means that all my calls are now being routed to another device. Not ringing on my desk phone, but ringing on an another device. Or I could have dual all, which means that all phones, all calls ring on my desk phone and all calls ring on that other device, i.e. that mobile or another extension somewhere else in the building or my home phone or wherever that other location is. This covers pretty much any way of working for anyone who wants to set up their diverts. And usually most people are able to leave them in that single state all the time. But if you did need to change it, you can see how quick and simple it is. The settings screen allows even further customization of the PCS handset to suit your own requirements. The defaults button takes us into another screen, which allows us to refine the way that the system searches the directory of contacts to improve the performance of that. We also have the idle page, and the idle page, or default page, is what is appearing on the screen when nothing else is happening on the phone. Some people like that perhaps to be history, or they could select it to be their favourites, the BLF page that we saw earlier, or indeed the logo page. And in this particular instance, we further customised it by the system administrator placing a customised logo into the screen.